Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today I have garlic. You're probably wondering what the heck do you have garlic for? I'm gonna show you. Good morning. <laughs> Are you letting your baby run free? We're in our pajama stoves. I put her in that stall. She's like, I'm gonna go under it. She went under the door? She tried to. Well, I'll let her run. Well, I don't want her getting out to the other room. Just let her run in here. Just let her run in here. Close the door. Woo. Come on, Lola, she says. Let's go get my wheelbarrow. I want me to leave her. Good morning, Ellie. <laughs> Today was rough. Hi, Grace. Hi, sweet girl. Hello. She's like, I want the garlic. <laughs> she wants the garlic. Anyways, today was rough. I woke up early. I woke up early. No, I woke up at the normal time. I forgot to make sure Gabby was awake. And of course, she slept in. And I'm like, holy cow, Gabby, you only have 20 minutes. But she made it. She made it, and she doesn't even complain. She's like, oh, okay. <laughs> so as most of you guys probably know, garlic, garlic is a, is a natural antibiotic. So I'm gonna give it to the goats. I'm just gonna double check and make sure they can have it in pregnancy, but I'm pretty sure they can. But I'm gonna give them a do the goats a dose of it just because I don't know like where they were before us kind of thing. Like I don't know, they don't seem sick or anything, but I'm gonna just do it. A natural antibiotic can't hurt. And we have a fridge down here, it just works out. So after we got Gabby off to school, I realized that the fair here is coming today. So that's what we're trying to do, get ready for the farrier. Sam ran out to do the horses and I'm down here trying to get the girls out. Okay, so the farrier is done. It was really sad for me. Like the last time the farrier was here was when we were dealing with Chino and she helped us a lot and it just made me sad. So the horse show is coming up really, really quickly and we still have a few things left to do. So Gabby and Sophie are both gonna be doing the costume contest and then Gabby's going to be jumping in the derby. It's a derby show. So we got Gabby's costume in the other day. I love it. It's like the, we it's the like craziest costume we've ever done. Costumes are hard for me, so we ordered one and I love it. I saw a video of somebody wearing this costume and loved it. So I got it for Gabby because he's a black horse and I wanted it to kind of tie in with him being a black horse. So we got that and um, I'm not gonna show you guys until the day of, or maybe I'll show you tomorrow. Maybe we'll show you tomorrow Gabby's costume. Maybe we'll do like a dry run. Actually, that's what we should do. We should do a dry run. Okay, so because we have to like build on Sophie's costume a little. Uh, we have to go out and get a few things for Sophie's costume. We need to get some sweaters for her goat because she thinks that it's gonna need sweaters, it's tawny. She's so tawny, like looking at her today, she's really pretty, quite tawny. She wants to get sweaters, but I told her she can only use them just in case, just in case it gets like really, it's gonna like be wet or whatever, and she, anyway. So, then we have to get some stuff for the parade. We're gonna be in a parade again this year. So we need to get, she's gonna bring the baby goat in the parade, she changed it from a horse to the baby goat, so. We have a lot of running around to do before the horse show. It's a, it's a get everything done day. What were you doing today? I saw you out there in your tractor while I was with the farrier. Yeah, I'm doing fields and spreading the manure. Spreading manure! And you got something else that was really cool? What was the other thing that you got? Oh, that's a um, spear for the hay, for the big round bales. And so he got a spear for his tractor so he can move the round bales and we don't have to get somebody to bring like their tractor and spear them and put them where we want them. So that's exciting. I got a blade. I got it at the tax store. I'm so glad. So the one I had was the number 10. This is a fifth this is a 15. So the higher up you get, the closer it cuts. And I actually didn't like how long mine left. So I like it. I'm excited. So, anyways, it cost it cost $67 with tax to buy a new blade. $67. I think the machine that I have is like $99. So it's almost worth it just to buy a new machine every time. But, so then I said, do you know where I could like sharpen my blades instead? And they said, yeah, they have a guy. Actually, I didn't even write any information down. I just gave them my blade. Didn't even tell them my name or anything. They know me though. So $15 to sharpen the blade. 
So I'm gonna find out on Amazon if I can find something that sharpens the blades myself, but I'm happy to have two blades anyway. I wanted two blades because I'm gonna be clipping horses for a lot of years and I'm gonna be clipping my dog for a long time, hopefully. Worth it. So uh, I'm good. <laughs> Let's go finish what we need to do. I got Sam a cup, you guys. It says if dad can't fix it, we're all screwed. And then it has a screwdriver for a handle. It's his coffee cup. Isn't it adorable? Do you like it? Yeah, I like it. Poor storm is wet. It's been the crappiest day, you guys. I need to get my coat out of the van. Don't let me forget. We left all the lights on and Sam didn't complain. I got a blade for my thing though. I'm gonna do something really risky. Come on. Come on. <laughs> uh oh, hurry up before Gracie comes. Don't take off on me, please, because I'll be in trouble. <laughs> He's a little wet. Look at that. What a good boy. I'm just gonna close this door <laughs> because with my luck, anything could happen. I hate that he didn't have his blanket on today. It's supposed to be really warm today. And it was really warm today. But it rained. Whew, everybody's wet. Everybody is wet. I often see messages from people saying we need a new trainer. Not often, not anymore, but occasionally. Oh, I have chocolate milk in the fridge. Did you see it? No. Do you want it? It's there. Yeah. I got it today and I was thinking, I'll just save it for Gabby. I need a change for the farrier. What's really weird about that is that I love our trainer. Like I love him. I handpicked him. I won't have a trainer for our kids that doesn't have the same values that we have. I don't want a trainer that's like screaming and yelling and mean. I don't want one that teaches in a way that I don't feel comfortable with. And don't you attack me. And more importantly than all of those things, I want a trainer that my kids can understand. And Brandon definitely is hard to understand. Except for Gabby, for Gabby. Gabby can understand him and really enjoys riding with him. And Gabby loves him. And if a problem comes up and we needed to train, change trainers, we would, for sure. But I believe in Brandon for so many reasons that not everybody sees because I don't share it in our videos. I don't share him. You guys just see little snippets of lessons and stuff. But the man is honestly the most giving, kind man I've ever met in my life. And I trust him with my children. And that's saying something. Did you get the chocolate milk? No. You want me to get it for you? Yeah, hang on. I got boots on now. I just saw Gabby <laughs> fill her water bottle up with water. And then I said I had chocolate milk in the fridge. And I just saw Gabby dump her water. <laughs> All right, are we ready to roll? Just waiting for Slowpoke. She's yeah, coming. Oh, you got some. Bye, Pen. We'll be back. Let me turn off the light. I swear all the cats across the road wait and they watch us leave. And then the minute we leave, they're like, run! They look green! <laughs> they make me laugh. Do you want me to get him like a blanket or something to put on in the trailer? Grab a cooler. Ooh. Yay! This is the very last lesson before the horse show. So let's hope it goes well. It looks like it's been kind of rainy all day, so it looks like we're running inside. I don't know if that's gonna help us, but let's go riding. So this is Elizabeth's horse. We're just saying hi to him because she's not here. She doesn't ride on the same nights as us. This is him though. Happy guy. Okay, we'll see, see you later. <laughs> He's like, bye. <laughs> All right, we got the row. We got all the horses. We got Grape in today. We got Stormy and somebody cleaned out the trailer. <laughs> Took all the saddle pads out. Didn't tell Gabby. <laughs> so we're using one from our barn. Storm, what do you think? We're riding inside today. Did you clean off his feet? Uh, no. Oh. <laughs> Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the 